still do that. Oh, also, I washed some clothes because I wanted to wear, I wanted to wear my shorts again. Anyway. So as you can see from the montage that I did earlier in this video, <coughs> sorry, I'm going through puberty. It is clear that I definitely showered for this video. And I don't know, I just want, I just want to get respect for that. So just write down in the comment section below how much you respect that I shower for these videos. Thank you. Or like the video. That also works. So on today's video, we're going to be watching episode seven, seven and eight. Um, hello? Just <laughs> gonna watch me eat. That's weird. Some people can eat really pretty. I can't. This, this is, is not okay. This is why I don't eat on camera. This needs to stop now. Uh huh. <laughs> That's so ugly. And I always like stuff my mouth. <laughs> Mm. I mean, like, there are some people that can eat with just an appropriate amount of food in their mouth. I'm like that. I'm not about that life. If my cheeks aren't, like, out here while I'm eating, I'm not doing it right. I'm Miss three servings of shomai. Do I have two other friends to share it with? Yeah, but I'm not gonna... not gonna do anything about that. Shomai? Ah! Um... No, I'm trying to make it seem like this just naturally falls off my shoulder like this. Hi. You should be looking at my screen right now. And if you are, yes, that is me watching Julian make <laughs> vegan sushi. I have no intention of making vegan sushi. There's no reason for me to be watching this, but I am watching it because it makes me happy. Actually, before we get to this, can I just very quickly show you guys something that was sent to me on Twitter? Where is it? This one. This one right here. Uh, the person who tweeted me this, BHSS girl. I just want to say a few things about this video. I, I, I don't even know how to say it. No, it's like <laughs> dynamic. Di dynamic. Complex. Complex is a better word. Soon go out tonight. I was just, just like so happy to. But, uh... First of all, his like everything, everything you are, you are, you yes, hello, yes. The you have to respect this, this, this young man. Yeah. Like nothing else, you know. It was like yeah. I, I... Mental illness is kind of a hot topic. Uh, especially like right now, it's pretty topical. So there are a lot of shows that are coming out with different types of mental illness features in their shows. I believe, I strongly believe, that Scum is one of the few that manages to treat that as respectfully as possible without it looking caricature. It just really managed to package an incredible season that features a, a character with mental illness with such care. I'm gonna export my son here. No. No, no. What the f***? What the f***? What the f***? What? <laughs> Don't you hope that? No, fucking me. What? <laughs> okay, not gonna lie. I've heard that there was a mural. So yeah, I knew that a mural was going to appear. I just didn't know how they were gonna do it. This is embarrassing. You have the stalker, man. What? There's a dude who fit. Why does he know it's. Wait. Oh no, what did I miss? He knows it's a dude. <laughs> Trouwens, wie zegt dat een gast is? 
How many chicks do you spray? How many chicks do you know that spray? First of all, no, like spray paints. You think that spray painting is reserved for men? How is he ever gonna come out to this guy? Bro, this guy is so narrow minded. Been so like, uh, uh, uh. what the f kind of mentality? So, what do you think is gonna happen if a girl touches a spray paint can? She's just gonna combust into flames. Uh, uh, nor. What? Yeah, exactly. Nor Thank you. It's so sexy, man. <laughs> <laughs> it looks pretty good though. Why did he choose this area? I'm wondering. Is that because it's just a band? Is this like a random area or is there some sort of significance as to why this is where he chose to put the mural in? Have you ever had anyone? I, I don't relate to that at all. No one has ever like spray painted my face. on a, That's not an invitation by the way. I don't want that. That feels kind of, it feels very Xander. Which, if we have established anything from the last time I watched, Xander's a little out there. So, oh, this is the shape of a heart? I just realized that. Anyway, I've seen other murals in SCOM. This ranks pretty high, I would say, in the, in the SCOM mural uh, ranking list. Does that exist? We should. Someone start that. Someone start a ranking, like a list of SCOM murals, and then put this in number one. Because it is. Is that an Instagram? Oh, they took a picture of it. Are they making fun of it? That's bullshit. Milo, this is this. Oh, <laughs> hi friend. Can we talk? Secret stuff. Oh. So if this is Oh my God. Wow, laser vision. I can't believe he saw that all the way from the door. I guess when it's just like something gay. You sniff it out. That's a talent, Milan. And from wie is deze ode aan jou? Who'd you f think, bitch? Van Sander. Echt? Yeah. Wow. Well, I was right. Je weet dat Sander en ik iets hadden. Toch hadden? Yeah. Ja, die, die ochtend daarna hadden wij gebeld en hij was ineens helemaal anders. Ik kan met hem naar het flikje gaan, maar hij... Ja, yeah, what, what do you think that is, Milan? Weet jij dat, snap je dit? Die Brit, hoe, um, hoe lang zijn zij al samen? Six months. Ik weet niet. Six months. He said Een half six jaar months. of zo. Ja. Yeah. What? Why? Ik ken zeg maar een heleboel jongens die een soort van klassieke jonge meisje, suikers, binnensprookjes, Disney-achtige relatie hebben. Mm -hmm. And he doesn't stick him with young in bed. It's basically the same. He thinks like I mean it's it's the same as like the past, gay gurus. I thought he would have a different conclusion. Damn. Sind doch noch eine Fassmaschine kaufen. Ich kann ein bisschen besser schrubben, eh? Or you could get a dishwasher. I agree. Oh shit. What? No 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 no. Leave doesn't mean come in. I have it pissed, I quit it. Oh, he has a knife? It isn't clean, too. If he stabs him, that could be a lot of infections. Sorry. For what many you done. You know what? This is so creepy. You should have, like, maybe asked him to meet you somewhere. Maybe not go to their house where you're clearly unwelcomed. Oh, well. Broer. I hope that you're not that in sight. Just go, man. I know that you're crazy. See him. This is a very touching scene, and I'm, I'm touched. But I also would like to know how girls are able to find hair ties that are exactly their hair color. Is that just her hair like wrapped around the ponytail? You can sit here and judge me and tell me that's irrelevant and I've completely missed the point of this entire clip. I would argue that no, I get what the entire clip's about. In addition to that, I also recognize this and how that's a marvel. Wait, what? Nora said herself that she didn't make that piece. There's no trigger warning, so I don't know what's about to happen. I don't know if things are gonna get violent or ugly. I don't know what to expect, but I'm expecting the worst. 
here's what I want. I actually wouldn't mind if these two idiots, mostly Mo Mojo, 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 mostly that guy. If he were to just be honest about how he doesn't agree with Robo being gay, how he thinks that's disgusting, I want him to say all these things that he really feels. I don't think he's gonna be accepting Robo unless they like the writers do a complete 360 out of nowhere and suddenly he's accepting of Robo being gay, even though he's highly misogynistic and ignorant. Do it, and then Robo can drop you, finally. Can we just take him out of the boy squad? Because I'm over it. There's no redeeming qualities for him anymore, and it would not be believable if suddenly he's just nice out of nowhere, or so quickly. Like, after a week, he changes his mind, and he's like, oh, Robo, I'm so sorry. Turns out, you know what, the gays, I'm cool with that. So, as that not van nor is, then he has a guy, man, be there. Shit. Hey man, that's sowieso een van die skaters, man. Je met zijn lange haar. Die is ook altijd zo te kijk. Zo creepy, toch? <laughs> that's so creepy. Such a dude being into you. Come on, Mojo. Come on. Just do it. Just say you're grossed out by gay people. Just do it. Give me a reason to hate you even more, you f***er. Oh, yes, this is the hell on the beauty. Why is that creepy, on? Yeah, why is it creepy? <laughs> what? Sander. <laughs> Waarom maakt hij dan zo'n piece over you? Omdat hij mij wil zien zitten. Zeg het. Als hij zitten zitten. Ja. 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 Wie of wat? Gross man. Dat klopt niet zo bij de kant. Wat is er gross aan? Ik zou me niet op mijn gemak voelen moesten gaan zitten. Ik zie hem ook zitten. Oké. Look at his face. Look at look at look at his face. Oké. Look at that. Completely clueless. Doesn't even understand what the f is going on. Now he's probably thinking back to all of the times that he maybe, I don't know, showered next to Robo or Robo was like next to him and like his touch lingered a little. Now he's probably thinking about all of that because you were so self centered. You're probably thinking that Robo was into you too. He's like, oh, oh, oh my god. You how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. I think I just got a hernia. <laughs> I'm an outing. Ja. Maar ik heb er een heleboel voor in de plaats teruggekregen. Shoot it out of here! Do it now! Like it's happening over him. It's happening over us. Someone didn't wash the dishes correctly again. It's probably not that. Oh my God! You know what? Just get them a dishwasher for Christmas. It might ease the tension. It might. Hij valt op mannen. Yeah, yeah, for too. Welcome to the LGBT. It's not so easy as with All right, cool. Yeah, nice. Does she want to know if like Rob is really gay? Zet he gay? Yeah. Ik heb fucking te veel moeite voor u gedaan. Oh. Hey Robus, dat is allemaal energie die naar andere targets te kunnen gaan. <laughs> ja, sorry, maar. Maar. It's not his fault, but. Cute. Tina, not me. Damn it, they're hanging out. Are they gonna make up? I don't want them to make up. <laughs> Hi. Hey. Alles chill? Huh? Is it? You tell me. Ça va? What? What? So he tells uh, Pot. Ja, nee, van seksueel. Die zeggen verliefd wordt op een persoon. Ja, yeah, you wouldn't know that, would you? Zo shit houdt jij je bezig. <laughs> Geen wiskunde, je moet geen oefeningen maken. Nee. What the f do you what the f do you think about? Verliefd wordt op iemand die helemaal niet ziet zitten. En je blijft er toch zo achter huppelen. Zo. Ah, was <laughs> Loser, toch? <laughs> What's your problem? Anyways. Ik ga pissen, joh. Is that it? Was that supposed to be like them going back to normal? Because it's not like Mojo is just mean to gay dudes. He's mean to even straight dudes. He's mean to everyone. He's just generally mean. Is that it? Is that what I'm supposed to be getting from that? Because no. I'm just going to the choice to stellen. Wel 100% contact of wel geen contact. Yeah. Stuur hem anders gewoon. Maar nu. Ja, nu hoor hem niet. Dan werd je trekt. My God, they're gonna reunite. This is the reuniting episode. Well, that's some, um... Als ze dan zou zeggen, 
Dat is... Then you'll have an answer. Dan is dat pijnlijk. En nog altijd minder pijnlijk dan deze shit, hè. Yeah. You didn't respond. Scene? Wow. Oh! Hi! How long have we been standing there? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 no. We have to talk. Robbe? No, no, oh. No, 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 no. You have to talk. No, 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 no. No, oh no, his eyes. Can talk later. <laughs> it's cool. Yeah, you talk later. So you're not going to like this. Hi, by the way, it's editor Noah. I cannot show the entirety of this the love scene um, because I might get demonetized. YouTube is now trying to align much more firmly with COPA, which is the Children Online Protection Act, and I just have to work around it. And this is one of those workarounds. It'll be great. See you on the other side, bitch. I don't think that's part of his house, so that's risky. Oh my god, everyone can see! Aren't people home? You guys! Guys! Uh, guys! <laughs> Me in this situation, it's like, guys, can you like move, like really quickly, can you like move this to the bedroom? Like, my nieces are here, they're visiting. No, keep them on, kinky! No? Okay. Oh yeah, they've never had sex yet, huh? From your promises. Wait! Wait, what? <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Oh, that's a lot? Jesus. Oh my god! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> no! <laughs> um, what? Uh, <laughs> what? You know what's funny? It's like, in Scum France, they're like fully naked in a lot of those shots. Here, they're not even fully naked, but for some reason, it's it's more it like. It hits different. Oh, I know why I hit different. Cause they hit that nip. That's why. Where did he go this time? Oh, but did he actually leave? Hey. Uh, yeah, his boyfriend. Is weg, Milan. Hij heeft niks gestuurd, hij is niks achtergelaten, hij is weg. Nee, misschien is er een hele logische verklaring dat hij... Ik heb toch best iets van te gaan getuigen. Echt? Hey! Dus ja. Doe het volgende zelf eens, hè? Niet voor u. Goed, het is de beste manier om te doen. Oh, hij is weg! Oeh, heerlijk. Je boyfriend heeft smaak, hoor. Ah, oh, die Belgians in oh. your croissants. Yeah. Can I have some? The croissant, not the boyfriend. Voorop zeg jij van mij nog niet vanaf, hè? Een mm. Brit dan. Brit wie? You know which Brit. You know. Dat is voorbij. For good? Honderd procent. Mm. You said that last time, sort of. Dat heb je vorige keer ook gezegd. Ik meen het. Yeah. So you didn't mean it last time? Xander. Blijf vast. Now you made him drop Jump his croissant! <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Oh no, I made myself laugh. <laughs> you could sneeze in his direction, and Aaron would be like, Yeah, that girl's into me. I miss Bazir. <laughs> so he's still part of the group, like, we're just not gonna talk about him seeing those things? We're just gonna skip over it? Like a thing? Yeah, I grijp wel uh, waarom je voor hem bent gevallen, Robert. Oh, mojo, niet nie Sander. What are you doing? The fuck? Hey, Jesus, is like niet gay? Nee. Jij? Niet gay. Weet je wat ik denk? Ik denk dat jij gewoon nog een klein beetje in de kast zit. Is er recording in? Maar als ik nou vanavond bij jou blijf. Oh. Hmm? This is kind of predatory. <laughs> <laughs> He uses derogatory terms. He makes Robba feel uncomfortable. Robba pranks him once. They're good now. Everything's fine. Everything is sunshine, rainbows, butterflies. Nothing was ever wrong to begin with. Cool. This shot looks cute because it's almost like everything around him is in black and white except for him. Oh, look at how different his reaction is to seeing Xander waiting for him after school compared to like with Noor. Remember that? Like a hundred years ago? Mensen! Oh yeah, my god! Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god! Klots! 
zak. Oh my god. Ik ga net bij mijn lief vandaan, oké? Okay? Fuck off, ja. We zijn voorbij. Hoe vaak moet je dat nog zeggen tot dat bij je doordringt? Voorbij gedaan, sloes. What is sloes? Sounds horrible. Oh my god, I have to watch that again. Klootzak. 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 Oh my god. You stay away from my boyfriend? Well, I mean. Vaak moet je dat nog zeggen tot dat bij je doordringt? This is too much though. This is a little, like, that's really embarrassing. But then again, she did attack him first. This is so messy. Nee, is precies niet. Ja, ik heb daar al duizend keer gezegd en gestuurd. What the f***, man? Jesus. He's off. He's going off. And also, like, text messages? You didn't have the gall to tell her in person? Sander. Zeg, maar kunnen we nu zijn dertiende? Kunnen we eens bijpraten? Friday is the 13th. We got a Friday the 13th. Oh, it's this It's this approaching Friday is Friday the, the 13th. That's going to be an interesting episode. Heb jij je schoen al gezet? En dan suikerklontjes en een wortel. Wat? Wat is de scent? Geen schoen. Ah. Op pakjesavond. Op pakjesavond. Hoe durf je? Package night. Belgium. <laughs> What about Belgium? Shoe, carrot, um, um, sugar cube. A carrot, a sugar cube, an apple, etc. is put in the shoe as a treat for Sinterklaas. Oh! The next morning the carrot is gone and the children find candy for presents in the shoes. Drawings made by the children are put in the shoes as a present to Sinterklaas. St. Nicholas. So why did they just put out the one shoe? They should all put out shoes so that the presents can be like in all the different shoes. You can't just like put that full responsibility on Sanders' shoe. Also, what kind of shitty ass present is gonna fit in a shoe? No disrespect to you, Belgium. I'm just saying like, well, I guess car keys fit in there. Celebration in Belgium and the Netherlands. December 6th. Ah, I see. But you definitely know Santa Claus, don't you? I mean, kind of condescending. Santa Claus doesn't really come to Belgium or to the Netherlands, not even to Luxembourg or Northern France. <laughs> Just imagine Santa Claus flying all over the cities, right? Starts from America, I get, oh no, 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 sorry. He starts from the North Pole and he's like, he's he's just done uh, like his whole shift. Let's say he's in Southern France because for some reason, Southern France wasn't mentioned here. <laughs> and his helpers are like, okay, time to go to Northern France. And the Santa's like, nah, bitch, I ain't going to no Northern France. And you know what? While we're on this subject, I ain't going to Luxembourg either. I don't want to go to the Netherlands and I don't want to go to Belgium. My shift ends here. <laughs> the children here in Belgium get plenty of presents and sweets. In fact, they are better off than the kids in most other countries. Okay, sure. Keep telling yourself that. Elderly man with white hair and a long beard. Sinterklaas wears traditional bishop's attire. I mean, damn that garb though. I, that's kind of cool. Where's the horse? Sinterklaas doesn't live in Belgium or in Holland. Nor does he come from the North Pole like Santa Claus does. <laughs> he was an honorable man. He was an honorable man, not like Santa Claus. Is he the one in costume? I will riot. Is he the one in costume? Bruh! Oh my god! And it has seen any slickers. Ik heb wel iets lekkers. Oh, je valt op oude mannen met paarden of wat? What are you doing? Penthouse fitter. Stop! Stop! Ja. Kom. And you're wearing that? Is echt waar? Super groot bed. I love how no one, like none of the staff members are batting an eyelash at this. Like, yep, that's just little old Sinterklaas taking up a boy to the penthouse suite. That's what he does. See, this is something we never got in the past time. Shower sex. Jesus Christ. Wow. They went for it. They went for it. You're out, you out here, guys. You're really out here doing this. Oh, look at that. That's so pretty. The carpet. They're in paradise. Not for long. I'm going to on your week's night, though. I can't believe that they can just, like, say these things so casually. That's... That, that is... Oh, that's a lot. Summer. Er is niemand die mij hier ziet.
I'll say this much. Like, this guy, this actor, he's doing pretty well. It's, like, it's subtle. Like, you don't really see it. And this is also what I liked about Hendrix's performance in episode 8. It was the fact that you weren't sure what you were looking at. Oh my god, this hotel is perfect, too. The decor of this entire, like, hotel, this penthouse, looks insane. Mismatch. Nothing kind of looks like it goes together. Is this it? This is it? Oh my god, that shot! This shot! That shot is so creepy and cool! Look at it! Oh my god, it's like a music video. Wow! It's like framed perfectly too. Like it's... The hands look dark, it's like it's someone else that's holding him. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, they ended it there! They chose to end it there! So it is a mental illness thing. That does not excuse his behavior as to why they didn't want to go to the cops. Um, it could be possible, I forgot where I read this, but some one of you like told me that uh, the fans are theorizing that the reason why Xander didn't want to go to the cops in the first place was like, what if he had a run in with police before? And that's why he doesn't want to go to the police. Now, I hear what you're saying. I don't think that's a good excuse either, because the way that Xander treats Ropa, saying that he's in love with him, saying that he's his everything, but you can't go to the cops because you could possibly get in trouble. Like there's no way at all for you to like help the guy that you're so deeply in love with. Another thing that I read was like, well, they're they're square now, they're even because uh, Robo called him a derogatory term because Robo did something wrong. So now Xander did something wrong. So now they're square. Um, no, also no, because a, a derogatory term does not equal the both of them almost dying. I still don't get what's happening with Brit then. I don't understand the creative decision then to make it so that Brit was the girl to play the Sonia part. Why her? Those are my thoughts. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I, I don't know what to do with my- I have to pee. Um.